So, so God tells Moses, my name is YHWH, an unpronounceable name. Uh, there are some teachers who will say in their classroom, this is what Rob told me, that in his classroom he has had a teacher who said, we're not going to try to say it because we're not going to say it wrong. Right? God gave God's name. It was so difficult to say that there are teachers now who don't even try to say it because they know they're going to say it wrong. And, and there's something to that, isn't there? That, that God picked you to be people who wear God's name. But I don't think it surprises God that you don't always live up to it. I think God picked you even though God knew that you weren't going to wear it perfectly. That there are going to be times that what you wear isn't what you do. And, and maybe the reason is this. Maybe what God wants from us is for the center of our existence to not be our ability or inability to wear God's name appropriately and instead be the fact that God has given us God's name. But shame would say, I'm never good enough, right? The difference of shame and guilt, guilt says what I did is wrong and shame says I am wrong. Some of us go, I, I, I'm never good enough and maybe the very point is that God knows that you can't ever wear it perfectly. Whichever response you are, I think God has a word for you today. Because God wants every one of us to follow Jesus' command and to pray, Our Father who art in heaven, holy be your name.